In these clips, we're going to talk about the proper way to remove and replace an engine valve cover that is cracked, excessively worn, rusted out, or otherwise defective. In this clip, we're going to talk about cleaning up the cylinder head mating surface. As you can see, if you look around, uh, you can see exactly where your gasket goes. And what we want to do is, is have it a nice, fresh surface for our gasket and new valve cover to mate to. This is the cheapest spray solvent on the shelf. Um, I recommend getting it from these guys right there. Uh, I've shopped around and this is where it's at. You don't particularly need to use engine degreaser or anything like that. Pretty much what you're looking for is just a volatile spray solvent. Um, I'm going to spray away from the engine just uh, for posterity's sake. You don't want to blast a bunch of this goo down into your engine. It does have a filter and the filter will pick it up, but you don't want it floating around in there for the one trip it'll make anyway. I'm going to take it and blast away. You're also going to want to use your shop rag. As you can see, it's coming pretty clean. You don't want to use any kind of metal scraping devices on your cylinder head. Uh, nine times out of ten these days, unless you have an older, like a vintage vehicle, the cylinder head's going to be aluminum. If you were to take a razor blade and try and remove this stuff, unless you are extremely careful, you may scratch the mating surface and cause an imperfection greater than your gasket's ability to seal would result in the leak for you. Don't want that to happen, so just use your cleaner and a shop rag. If it's a cast iron cylinder head, feel free to go ahead and scrape away on it. Uh, that stuff's generally tougher than the stainless they make a razor blade out of. All right, there we go. Um, for your plug galleys, if your vehicle has them or not, um, this one does. You can see these holes here. They're where the plug wires run into the spark plugs in the top of the head. Um, like I said, you don't want to spray this stuff directly in your engine, so just spray it on your rag. Give it a good soaking down and wipe around the sealing surface. All of this here does not get gasket on it, only right around there. You can actually see the ring from where the gasket seats. It's not necessary to clean up any of the other stuff. There'll be one for every cylinder your engine has. This is a four cylinder, so we got four. Make sure to get them all. If you're not sure what size or how many cylinders your engine has, refer to the owner's manual. That'll let you know. 